All right, guys, so we're having a really slow start to the day. I don't know why, but for some reason I didn't wake up till like 11 o'clock. So I already missed the first two and a half hours of shopping day. So we've already been to two stores and the wife is now at work. And I picked up at one store a cryo cuff cooler. I've had a couple of these. These usually sell for about anywhere from 15 to $30, depending on which one you get. And this is an Imaginex Alien. And I can't remember his specific kind, but this sells for about $20. And he was picked up in the bag of toys thing. So I only paid $1.50 for a whole bunch of toys in a bag. And I let the kids figure out, figure out which ones they wanted. And all I wanted was this. So, all right. That is Goodwill Stores number one and two. And we are on our way to Goodwill Store number three. So we just left Google store number three, and I got a whole bunch of t-shirts, a few CDs, some DVDs, a book, but what I really wanted to point out was this. Six second abs. Now, I've been selling these for a while, but I don't usually find them on the first Saturday of the month. Now, if you ever find them, take out the bands. The whole machine is worthless. You take out the bands, make sure you have all four, and they sell for $19.99 free shipping all day long. I've actually gone out of my way. I've purchased some on eBay before just to turn around and sell. It's like I found one, somebody had a brand new one that was selling in uh, England the other day and I purchased it, sent it into Amazon and it sold for 70 bucks. Yeah. All right, so uh, I spent like $14 here at this store and Whole bunch of t-shirts, I got my money back on the bands right there. So alright, so that is Goodwill Store number three, and we're on our way to Goodwill Store number four. And they really want the alien, even though they already have one. Alright guys, so we just left Goodwill Store number four. I spent like $25 at this store and I picked up Panasonic Omnivision VCR and I don't know what it is, but I've been finding these things like left and right lately. I mean every time I turn around I'm finding another one. And if it was normal time, I would not have been happy to pay the $25 for that. But being half price, I'll pay that. I would have asked, I would have actually gone to somebody like, can I get a price check on that? Make sure that's what they're supposed to be asking. Sometimes they will cut the price down. And yeah. These, I think I've got them all. I think there's six of them in there. And this thing usually goes, the spit tine usually goes for about 20, or 15 to 20, depends on where it's going. Uh, the door, you get like 15, dollars out of depending on the condition. That sticker, I'm not sure. Uh, the feet, if you can get the feet in good condition, they sell for $35 all day long. Every time I get a pair of feet that actually is in good condition, off of the Ronco Rotisserie 4000, they sell for $35. Now, if you get it for the Ronco Rotisserie 3000, it doesn't sell for as much, but they still sell. So, all right, that is Goodwill Store number four, and we are on our way to Goodwill Store number five. All right, so we just left Goodwill Store number five, and I spent like $10. I didn't get much, but I did get a Oster Carousel Rotisserie. It was missing the spit tine in the basket, but it still had all the other parts. I only paid five bucks on that, but I'll end up making like 20, 25. And my daughter, the Bat Freak. Bat Christmas lights! I don't understand the bat thing, but it's her thing. All right, so. She loves her bats. And don't you dare tell her that bats are evil. She will put you straight. I was going to show you what I picked up, but it was very windy and you wouldn't have been able to hear me. So, all right. So that is Goodwill store number five and we are on our way to Goodwill store number six. All right, everybody. So we just left Goodwill store number six and it is really windy out. Something that Sonia picked up actually hopped out of the van and tried to blow away on us. Luckily, we were able to catch it. So... I'd show you what I picked out, but it's really windy <laughs> and really loud. And we just had a nice little eventful time trying to get that item for her that she wants for herself. 
So, all right, that was Goodwill store number six. I think we spent like $8 there. We didn't find much, but I did find another six second app, so I'm happy about that one. So, all right, on to Goodwill store number seven. All right, everybody. So we ended up going to seven Goodwill stores and a Salvation Army. We got a late start for the day, and that was my fault. I don't know why, but I just could not get up. And normally on shopping day, I'm the one who gets up and moving, flying out the door before anybody else. And I'm the one to get them up, and nobody got me up, so we didn't get moving until 1130. So... Evidently, somebody really wants to show you all of the t-shirts because she's trying to hold them all up for you. So, I, evidently, I have to show you every t-shirt that I picked up. Yes, I got a lot. All right, so I'm going to start with what she's got here. I've got Captain America. And one at a time, not all of them at once. Uh, this is actually, I've got two of the same name brand, Five Jungle. And the closest thing I saw was they were going for about $35 in used condition, and that actually kind of confused me a little bit. How? Uh, Harley Davidson. What? I've got a... Evil shirt. It is not evil. This is X-Men. What? Yes, X-Men. Uh, this one is the Grim Reaper. Oh, so you're just going to sit there and watch me do it and not hand them to me now? I see oh. how it is. South Pole. Stormtrooper head. Yes, I have a Stormtrooper head. The only reason I actually picked this up is the tag being so big and floppy just kind of caught my eye. So, of course, I had to grab that one. Here. I've got a... What? Here's the back. It says Fatal. And I couldn't find this one in particular, but those were even similar to this. We're going for about 15, but it, it, it caught my eye. So of course I'm going to look it up. I have, oh, Vulcan in the streets, Klingon in the sheets. I'm a geek. So yeah, I have to keep that finger thing on. She sprained her finger. At first, we thought she dislocated her finger. Luckily, she didn't. She just sprained it. And this one, I'm just not completely sure. But it said buy me, so yeah. When you do so much thrifting as we do, sometimes you just buy and don't even think twice about it. And Griswold's Family Christmas, of course. And the mom is here. Yes, there's so much that. Right exactly where I was going to tell you to hang it up. Vader is coming. Look busy. <gasps> Vader, Vader! Vader head! <laughs> and I picked up one hoodie. It wasn't oh so great, but it was a Hurley hoodie. So, yeah. Next. Um, this one, I'm not even sure, but something about it just said, buy me, and I do that a lot. I, I lost my love of t-shirts for the longest time, and I think I've got it back. This one I actually picked up at Salvation Army. Black Veil Brides. Yes, it is a women's size medium, I think it was, or small, but it's super small. Even at that, normally the small sizes don't sell, and unless it's particular name brand bands and this is one and even use this small it'll still sell for like 20 bucks yeah. and sonia picked out a spider-man t-shirt that i don't have and the wife is yelling at me that i have too many t-shirts and i need to start getting rid of some next let's see here i've got Captain America, the Winter Soldier. Let's see here. I have a... Oh, yes. Star Wars The Force Awakens t-shirt. Yes. I'm very in the trash. Stop playing in the trash. Why are you playing in the trash? I'm playing 
the battery. Yeah, Mario. So there right. you. And Why this is a this? sleeveless Harley Davidson T-shirt. I've got another um, Three Days Grace. And I felt like I have failed my children because I asked them who this was and they said, we have no idea. So if nobody else knows, come on. It's the tick. What's that Shocking tick? that he says keen on the shirt. What's considering his battle cry is spoon. What's the tick? My poor child. I will take care of her. I will make sure that she knows who the tick is. There is Sif sneaking on by. All right, this is Rokaware T-shirt. Uh, I've I've sold several Rokaware T-shirts before, so I just don't even think about it when I see some of them. You can see this one is. Oh, it's this one. Shaun of the Dead. So yeah, I kind of could grab some. Zombie t shirts in a while. Spider Man! Spider Man! Another Spider Man t shirt that my daughter picked out. Alright, next. How many more? You're looking at them all. I oh, yes, I think I picked this one up for somebody. Always be yourself. Unless you can be a dragon. Then always be a dragon. I mean, come on. Who, want, who doesn't want to be a dragon? Be dragon? They have giant hordes of gold. Yeah. All right, so we've got... What was this? Curry. You know, I don't even remember. What? Oh. I have no idea. And we've got... Oh, yes. The Periodic Table of Pirates. And oh yes, Salvation Army. Billy Joel T-shirt tour of two thousand seven. Whoa! And got another Harley Davidson T-shirt. This one is Dublin, Ireland. Next, <laughs> we've got. Uh, I know this. I just can't think of it offhand. Infamous T-shirt. I've I know I've had a few. Oh, you mean Vampire Sucking? What? No. Uh, Ed Hardy T-shirt. Okay, that's enough. Next. Sushi. Oh, that's just. Avenged Sevenfold. Sushi. Next. <laughs> Don't worry, Sonya. We're almost done. Uh, Kitty Cat Universe. Kitty Cat Universe. Kitty Cat and Kitty Cat and this thing. Kitty Cat and meow meow meow. Yes, I, I know. And meow 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 meow. Something about this one just said buy me. It was a archaic T-shirt. I don't understand it, but I'm gonna list it, of course. Something said buy me. When you get so well. Oh yes, here is the other. Uh, five jungle t shirt. I got these at two separate Goodwills. They weren't at the same one, but it just, it really struck me. That one just was confusing. And of course, got them all for fuck. Uh, here is Genesis Tour 1980. It's a smaller size, but hey, I'll still take it. Now, let's see here. What was this one? Oh, yes. Porsche Stuttgart. Uh, the ones that, even though it's rather faded like this, even in this condition, it was going to sell anywhere from 15 to 35. So I'm not sure where I'm going to go with that. Yes, last shirt. And this is a Morador Middle Earth t shirt. <gasps> so. 
All right, kind of getting back in my love of t-shirts. I, I, I kind of missed them. They're easy. I've been having a lot of issues with Amazon lately, so I'm being extremely picky about what I've been sending in. So I'm, I'm going to go back to my roots and focus a little bit more on eBay because I really do enjoy just doing all the work myself. It's like doing all the listing, all the shipping, everything. It's actually kind of relaxing. And I kind of missed buying items for a dollar. And at the worst case scenario, double my money. I'm here to eat your brains. Really? Yes. My massive uh, mound of t-shirts. Oh, by the way, Daddy, You have one. You haven't played with it in months. And now you want to play with this one? Yeah, because it's green. Yours is green. No, it's blue. Really? Yeah. I'm not done with you. Like I said, I'm being really selective about what I'm sending off to Amazon. I've got this. I only paid a dollar for this, but something about it said, look me up, and I looked it up. In used condition, this thing is going for $40 on Amazon. And the rank was uh, number 200. And I picked up several of these CD holders. Adhesive CD holders. I could have sworn I had five. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I have four. So I picked these each up for a buck. They were ranked number 19. Okay. Uh, a few CDs, nothing really great and spectacular. DVDs, everything that I've been, for the most part, everything that I'm sending in is brand new. And this right here is my junior vice president and I will tell you why this is my junior vice president and why I take my kids picking with me she finds the good stuff I have you want braces. to go show them the VCR that you picked up I hate my braces yes uh -huh. she knows what to look for if you don't know my videos, this is the VCR I pick up every time I see one. Even if I see one that I don't think about it, I just grab them. If they don't exist on Amazon, I just straight up eBay them. They don't last long. 30 bucks every time. And there is a, it's big, it's bulky, I'm not going to grab it. Freeze. Go video. I said freeze. Double VCR with remote. I said freeze. If it exists on Amazon... They go for about $150 each, and I paid five bucks. Freeze, hey, freeze me. Uh -huh. You want to hand me this rotisserie? Oh. This? Oh, this. It's so heavy. No, the other one's heavy. Here is the carousel rotisserie by Oster, and it didn't have the basket. It didn't have the spit tine, but worst case scenario... Put my money back on that. I don't know why, but okay. I can't believe they were selling it without all of its parts. <laughs> so that one part is usually what sells first, and it usually sells for about uh, $15. And if I can get the knob off, okay, I'm not going to try too hard, but this knob goes for about $12. If you get it completely apart, the heating element, it takes a while for the heating element to move, but it sells for uh, 15 And the heat shield does come out. I think I don't even remember what that sells for. It's been, it's been a while since I've had one of these. I had one once before. And, uh, oh, Don, you want to hand me the six-second abs? The six second abs. You know which one that is. Oh, this thing. Yes. In case you didn't get a good look at it, the six second abs, every time, make sure it has. If I can pop it open real quick. 
go. One, two, three, four, four, four pieces. Yep, four bands. Because this is the only thing that you want. There's only two yellow. This is trash. I want this. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. I Sell like all day long for 20 bucks. They don't last on eBay for long. We got the Cairo, yeah, Cairo Cuff Cooler. That blue thing right there. I, I've had a few of them. They do move. It stinged my finger. It takes a couple months for them to move, but they still move. But it's still pick them up anyways. And I think for the most part that was it. Sonia, was that all? No. Oh, yes, the Ronco Rotisserie. I hadn't seen any for months, oh, and, and then all of a sudden, I've been seeing those left and right lately. And <sighs> if you can, if you can find them with the feet, and the feet in good condition, not broken, <laughs> the feet move quickly. The feet are usually the first thing to move, because I've had the feet, I've listed them, they're gone, thirty-five dollars. So. <laughs> All right, so that is all. I think we, how much did we spend? Do you remember? Two million or something? We did not spend two million dollars. If we had two million dollars, we would be doing a lot of private labeling, Sonia. So, all right, uh, I'm going to guess um, 90, 90 dollars? Maybe a little bit more, I'm not sure. But, all right, so that is all. Don't forget, like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below.